the hopping bird is inside ready for the late pick three good luck in all of your selections racing fans there's the red light we're set for the start and there they go in this 1350 meter event uh, a 3d just a shade slow coming out of the starting gate but it's the hummingbird who will bring them out of the chute and that's the one who shoots into the front so it's the hummingbird a leader by about four lengths racing in second spot is ukraine in company there with afridi also up there in the firing line we have man on fire fulfill in the yellow cap then comes Quasimoto along the rail and the trailer is pure strike. They just went by the 1,000 meter pole and raced towards the nine. And it's the Hummingbird setting the pace there by two and a half lengths. In second spot races a 3D. Ukraine races a clear third. The favorite fulfill is in fourth spot. Just ahead of Man on Fire. Quasimoto is one from last. The trailer is pure strike. They go towards the far turn and the Hummingbird continues to lead. Moving into second spot is Ukraine. Then comes a 3D now in third. Fulfill is now starting to get going for Kelawan now and he moves into third spot relegating a 3d in fourth then comes man on fire then quasimoto pure strike the trailer they come out from the far turn and the hummingbird is about to be swamped here by ukraine on the far side fulfill is racing in third then a 3d was going about five wide into the home stretch they come and ukraine has taken over the lead fulfill is on the outside the hummingbird is giving way running on from the back of the pack is a 3d and pure strike inside the final 200 meters and ukraine is kicked clear fulfill is being asked a question but i don't think he can get to ukraine because ukraine is pulling away and she's going to break her maiden today ukraine by four and a half in the end fulfill was second a 3d third the hummingbird faded to fourth the running time was 125.68 125.68 the running time Meantime, Samuel Cass fans, we're getting close to post time here for race number eight at Caymanas Park. Just two minutes remaining. Two minutes of wagering time remaining for race number eight at Caymanas Park. Eighth race field parading behind the start for race eight at Caymanas. Final call for wagers. The horses have reached the starting gate. They're loading into the gate for race number eight at Cape Manus Park. Final call for wagers. They're loading for race eight at Cape Manus. Number five, Ukraine, the winner. Number seven, Fulfill, second. Number three, Afridi, third. And number four, the Hummingbird, finished in fourth. Five seven three four, the unofficial order of finish. The running time was one twenty five point six eight. Final call for wages at Kimanas Park.
Hard racing fans, they're off and running at race number eight at Caymanas. Wagering is closed. They are racing now for race eight at Caymanas. Let's welcome into the winner's circle, breaking her maiden this afternoon, your fourth race winner, number five, Ukraine. She's a three-year-old Bay Philly by Da Vinci out of the damn sweet genius by Gold Market. Ukraine is owned by Dr. Pravin Sharma, trained by Jose William Samaru, and the winning jockey, the leading apprentice, Tristan Phillips. Congratulations, Tristan. The winning groom is Everett Phillip. Ukraine was bred by Mr. Bennett Nurse at the Synergy Stud Farm, Racecourse Road, Arima. Number seven, Fulfill, was second with three, Afridi, third, and four, the Hummingbird was fourth, five, seven, three, and four, the unofficial order of finish. The running time for race number four was 125.68. Congratulations to the entire team behind the success of Ukraine, breaking her maiden here in start number five. Congratulations. All right, racing fans, as I mentioned earlier, the jockey's race is getting pretty heated now. That win takes Tristan Phillips to win number 12 of the season. As I mentioned earlier, Phillips is already assured the apprentice title here. He's six clear from his nearest apprentice colleague. So he's going to become the champion apprentice of 2023. That's been sewn up. But the open jockey's title, wow, what a race. Give you a quick recap here. Dylan Kelowan out in front on 13. Tristan Phillips now with that win moves to 12. And Brian Boudram Singh is on 10. And the veteran, El Abrigo, he is on 9. Don't count out Abrigo yet either. He's well within striking range. We still have the Boxing Day card to come. And the late daily double with races 5 and 6. I'll keep you updated as the races unfold. Up next is the Grade 